Yo, all black now. Oh, he's launching it. <laughs> Thanks, bro. What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to Beamer Frame. You guys join us here with the Straight Pipe BMW M4. And today we're going to be chasing a whole bunch of supercars, including the cars from Daily Driven Exotics. So with less being said, let's hop inside the M4, get on the road. <laughs> we are on the highway and the sun is pretty much set by now. It's getting pretty dark. It's going to be our first POV at night in a long time, but also we're heading to a supercar meet down in Orange County, so we'll be out there for the first time in I don't know how many months. We've got about uh, maybe a 50 minute drive. Should be a lot of really cool cars in today's video. Let's go ahead and continue onward and pull up to the meet. Oh my God. like the E92 we just drove but it still sounds good nice and raw As you can see, it says we have arrived, and you can see the setting is very eerie, man. It's like foggy. M5 CS yellow headlights right there. We have a F90 M5 comp in front of me right here. So we're gonna pull in, park up, and see what's good. Nice M8 Grand Coupe. As you can see, the M4 is parked up, and we got about a long row of cars right here kind of like race car style so we're gonna walk through them a little bit gotta check out see what kind of cars pulled up to the event and i'm looking at some nice ones already we got an m5 comp right here m8 competition we just saw pull in but this man m5 cs my favorite color on this car is the green gold wheels four bucket seats inside this car this is a nice f90 right here uh, i think it's merino blue but full carbon pack spoiler diffuser Valtronic exhaust. I mean, man, this could be the next car. See, there are some sick supercars at the event. GT3, wide body AMG, a Venador, I believe it's SV, uh, Roadster right there, Huracan. We've got a nice McLaren 720 carbon everywhere. Nice AMG holding it down up front. 720S with the doors up right now. Just started the motor. But you can see kind of the fog right now, the mist, all the precipitation in the air. Pretty cool vibe, actually. Man, it's a big Fast and Furious vibe right now. Wow. Nice. Old school GT3. Man, look at the M5 CS just coming through so cool. It seems to be the day of yellow headlights. This one's a Viper V10. Latest generation. Really cool. Man. Drive safely. If you're going to race or do anything crazy. Be cautious with other drivers um, and have fun. That's the most important thing. So you guys heard the man. Everybody's starting up the motors. We're going to hop inside the M4 and get on the road. 
wow that's a nice lineup of cars in front of us as you can see we are now on the road gtr uh, dodge viper two huracans one of them being an sto oh that mclaren oh man sb and a nice 335 as well Oh, AMG. Thanks, bro. <laughs> everybody's taking over the gas station once again so we got the m4 looking good parked up next to an nsx a mclaren it's looking good it's a nice 7-eleven vibe right here as well but you see this is one of the lambos we were behind huracan sto all blacked out just looking sick oh my goodness gtr and shout out to the 328 the pump nice man i love these stos these things look so good especially in the all black spec man Nice wheel setup, carbon everywhere. Also a nice turbo uh, drop as well. They were getting photos and rollers out of this car. That's pretty sick. This is what we were hearing. It has definitely some kind of aftermarket exhaust on it. I know the new replacement to the Aventador just came out. I don't know, man. I still like the Aventador. It looks better. It looks just straight like a fighter jet. The new one looks nice too. Let me know what you guys think. I mean, I think this is just going to be one of those timeless cars that everybody's going to talk about forever. But man, just look at the gas station from this angle right here. AMG, Porsche, the Huracans. You know, actually, let's go check out that 488. We didn't really get a chance to see that thing up close. So they got the drone popping at the 7-Eleven too. Jeez. Man, red is always a good color on the Huracan. That color is like a Tiffany color. Really cool. Super sick. 
Wow, this is really nice. I like the wheel setup. Those might be, uh, I don't know, like BBS spoke. pulled in with sounded good but that a little bit better I mean, that's really nice back to what we we're talking about the e46 m3 wagon jesus man this thing has really come together it really looks special man i really like how it looks wow that is just really cool a lot of kids over here bugging out but i don't know if the parents are too happy just kind of look behind me see what's going on over there i don't know what's going on man but I think some of the kids like it. That's all that matters. So we can also see that uh, that GT3 RS that pulled in real hot, unreal. I mean, this thing sounded insane. But more importantly, look at the wheels. GPS. Man, you can see official takeover of 7-Eleven. Success. Oh my God, that is a C63, yo. <laughs> this is wild. <laughs> oh my god. to a stop you hear how oh he's launching it <laughs> man it's been one hell of a night so far pretty long man people out here driving crazy in orange county i ain't never seen nothing like this in my life i mean straight out of like a fast and furious movie for sure um, you can see Eric from, from Carbon Tastic 
in that E46 M3 wagon going crazy, man. It's just, it's cool to see all these cars actually being driven like they're intended, you know. And I really like this 488, it's like Tiffany blue color on it. Two more cars that weren't at the other drive, kind of parked up over here. So we're gonna check them out, a nice 992 GT3. This, and I'm telling you, man, I'm loving the 992s. Probably my favorite generation. Got a few uh, AMGs over here as well, red. Check this spec out. What do you guys think? Come with a Golf livery on an AMG Roadster. You don't see that every day. And a nice McLaren drop top as well. You know, it's kind of trickling out. More and more people are going home, so I think we're probably going to do the same here shortly. It's getting kind of late. Got to get up early tomorrow. But man, we can see Eric's car up close in the flesh after he was running it on the highway. You see he's got the nice carbon plastic steering wheel as well we're gonna see if we can uh, still do a pov drive on this thing what do you guys think i think it'd be pretty cool pretty unique he's got the valvetronic straight piped exhaust so not only is it a wagon but it's tastefully modified as you can see dde's um huracan is parked right next to it as well oh look at this g82 as well now this is nice again with the yellow headlight seems to be the theme tonight oh that is just sick oh the turnoff sequence, I've actually never seen that on these cars. That's really cool. Man, it's tough. Eric's E46 M3 might be my favorite, but this is definitely the competitor here tonight. It's between the two cars. Finally got a hold of the M5 CS on the inside, and we can see what makes this car so special. We have four carbon bucket seats inside of it. You can see the whole back of it, carbon buckets. But to see carbon buckets in the rear of a sedan, I can't think of another car that does that. I mean, ambient lighting, full interior is insane, man. Oh my God. You guys join us back inside the M4. We're gonna end today's video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Check us out on Instagram at BeamerFam. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.